Hey there people and welcome back. Uh, first I want to start with uh, just a quick uh, shout out to all of you that's followed my channel uh, and watched my videos and comments. Awesome guys, thank you for that. Uh, I had pushed 100 subscribers, I hope I can push 200 soon and uh, but then I need to uh, get out more content I know so uh, but thanks guys and everyone. So, uh, this video today is going to um, going to talk about uh, Xerom, Xerom, yeah, something, I think I pronounce it Xerom. Uh, this is a new side chain or a sister chain to uh, Ether1, for you, for you guys that are familiar with that, uh, Ether1 is... Uh, and decentralized uh, hosting platform for content like videos, uh, programs, website, whatever you want. And you can check more into that if you haven't seen it before. Um, I am running uh, two nodes on uh, this network. As you can see, I'm running one gateway node and uh, one master node on this network. Uh, so, let's get back to the the good stuff. So, what is uh, Xerom? Uh, basically, uh, all this tells us that Xerom will be a sidechain to Ether1 that uh, will uh, have every like new uh, improvements that's going to be rolled out to the Ether1 chain uh, will be tested on Xerom first. So, uh, can kind of call it like a <laughs> test chain. Uh, they will have their own uh, dev, uh, dev team, uh, their own uh, node system. As you can see down here, they will have like uh, four tires of, uh, of nodes. Um, and they will also have a airdrop for the people that's already holding Ether1. Uh, the important to remember is that you have to uh, keep your Ether1 in your private wallet, uh, not on an exchange, and you cannot hold it in uh, in the Fuse uh, the application, the, the holding game application. Uh, so you have to keep it in a wallet that uh, you have your private key or control your private keys. To get the airdrop, there will be a one to two ratio airdrop. So if you have like thirty thousand ETO, you will receive sixty thousand X zero. Um, and another note, uh, not notes uh, for you guys is that if you are running a master node or a gateway node or um, on the Ether one chain, you don't have to do anything with your balance. You will get um, your uh, the airdrop without taking the node down or anything so just have it up and running so you don't get any downtime and uh, less payments on your nodes uh, they also say in here that they will uh, have their own dev team but uh, a few from ether one dev team will probably be on both chains or both coins or blockchains or what you will call it um, this was announced about i think it's yeah this was actually announced today uh, they also have their uh, discord channel up and running and there you can go and see on different links uh, this is a really early state so uh, so a lot of the stuff is not complete and built yet um, the chain will launch at 28th of june uh, the airdrop will happen at June 14 uh, sometime uh, they di didn't announce the time so they uh, don't uh, have any manipulation or so um, but the, the the mainnet will launch on June 28 and then you will can start mine the coin uh, about the nodes uh, for me as I said, I have already two nodes on the Ether1, so just uh, the coins that I hold up on in these nodes will uh, 
get me enough coins to uh, to set up like a super node. So uh, I will probably do that when uh, when this this uh, chain rolls out. Uh, as I said, this is kind of a test net, but in the same way, they will have nodes that will work with the ETH OFS platform, that's the decentralized uh, or uh, hosting. So, uh, so it will have some kind of purpose anyhow, because it will the Ether One FS um, storage will have two change two blockchains to rely on, and not just one. So it will be more decentralized, as you can read in this uh, this. Uh, writings over here uh, after that it's actually not too much to say about it a uh, few of the de team or the team members are familiar from uh, ether one so uh, and a couple of new ones maybe I think um, and you can go down here and see like the distribution of the coins as you can see the co uh, the mining reward will go down by time and the node reward will go up and they will also have a small dev reward there's no pre mine or ico or anything to this uh, launch so um, but uh, i still think it's kind of like speculative for me i will probably mine it for a uh, sometime in the beginning just to like get on the train that's I'm, I'm doing with a lot of coins uh, they will have a block reward of 26 x0 and 13 seconds target block time um, another than that uh, this was just to give you a little uh, news actually for once um, the next thing I can quickly take you through is uh, I'm still mining ETH as you can see on all my AMD rigs. Uh, I'm still mining Aeon on my Nvidia rig, so not not much happening over there. Um, and last, my Twitter, come follow me. Um, it's a great community on Twitter and uh, Twitch as well. Uh, as you can see, it's little time since I made uh, a live stream uh, been crazy last few weeks uh, a lot of other stuff going on so uh, but we will get some new hardware in soon um, some Nvidia cards probably and uh, I will probably have a live stream then if uh, I don't uh, get the time before that so uh, like subscribe comment down below and uh, See you next time. Bye bye people and thank you for watching.